god, how many I have, though. And hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I want to try on some stuff I bought from Pretty Little Thing. And let's get into it. So in this haul I have a bunch of graphics and t-shirts and a couple of sweats. And I just wanted to show y'all. So yeah, let's get started because I have a lot of um, t-shirts and graphics um, like I'm gonna do those back to back there's like 10 or 15 of those so <laughs> the first thing I have I'm actually wearing I got one in gray and I got this one I forgot what color but it's the embroidered pretty little thing embroidered t-shirt oh I need to get it together so I'm gonna go, um, go down by the list so the first thing on the list is the Petite Navy Pocket Detail Cargo Trousers in a size 2, um, size 2 US. And I got this in a red and I got it in navy. So, okay, so I got a size 2 and I think a size 4 would have been a better choice. Um, the color is basically navy blue. Oh, what can you say? <laughs> um, and I didn't have scissors on me so I couldn't take this off but these always come with like the flannels and the pants I guess but yeah, um, yeah so these are the trousers the material is kind of thin it's like it reminds me of like a tablecloth so not the best quality but they do look nice I think if I wash it, they'll become a little, a little bit softer. But yeah, it's really thin. But I still like the style. I like the cargo pocket, and I don't know. I just thought it'd be cool to pair with um, a crop top or even like a graphic tee like this. But yeah, well, I'd give it like a six out of ten. <laughs> but let me try the red ones on. So these are the red ones, and these are like bright red. Okay, so these are the size 4, so let's see if these fit a little better. So these are the size 4 and they definitely fit better. Um, they feel like the same material, it's like that tablecloth-y kind of cheap material, but I like the style. So I'm 5'3 for reference. And I usually pass with a four on Pretty Little Thing, but I don't know. Yeah, these are nice. The only thing I wish they did have was pockets right here. That would have been perfect, but it's okay. I don't have really like bright colored pants so I just wanted these to wear with like a white shirt on top and like a bucket hat. Oh that'd be so cute. And the next item is the gray Atlanta slogan wash t-shirt. Oh my god, look how many I have though. Yeah, it's a lot in a size small and I think I got all of the t-shirts in a size small so um, yeah. Ooh, the material's nice okay oh yeah I definitely I made a good choice choosing a size small um I'm 5'2 again so I'm kind of short I'm 5'3 5'2 between 3 I'm almost 5'3 but I'm still 5 whatever I'm 5'2 slash 3 okay <laughs> um yeah this is how it looks this is really like soft material it's like soft t-shirt material it's not like thick like some graphics are kind of like like the rough type of material but these are really soft um I'm from San Francisco I'm from Bay Area so Atlanta I just liked it because the font and I needed like some graphics to style but I like it I like it and 
straight down. They look, um, they're about like my mid thigh, but I usually wear it like this, not to like show off my butt, but I feel like it just looks more, I don't know, slouchy, stylish. If I wear it like, like this, like cuff it over my, my stomach, <laughs> but yeah. Um, next, I, I'll i show, show uh, this one. I got the, the Space Jam t-shirt, and I've seen a lot of people have this one. Um, and yeah, I didn't know if it was from Pretty Little Thing until like I was searching for graphics. Oh, it's soft. Okay, so same type of material. Um, oh, it's so nice. Like, I feel like this would be nice to wear in the summer too. Like... It wouldn't make you overheat like it's a nice like kind of thin breathable uh breathable t-shirt material okay so this is the space jam t-shirt it's so cute i love it i could wear this to sleep wear it out wear it like this with my sweats or with some biker shorts and no complaints, A plus, I like this. Next, next is the Boys in the Hood t-shirt. Um, this one is so nice too. Um, oh yeah, okay. So, this t-shirt material is more, a little bit more thicker, but this is how it looks. Let me try it on. Okay, so this is the boys in the hood. Looks like this. And I do like it. Again, the t-shirt material is really good, really soft. And I just wanted this because I like the pop of colors. I like the movie. These are like um, nice colors to have in a graphic t-shirt. So got it nothing much to it it's just a t-shirt but uh yeah just wanted some graphics um next next is the white brooklyn slogan oversized t-shirt in a size small again um and i really like the colors on this one too it's a nice graphic t-shirt not from bronx not from bronx not from new york city but this is a nice t-shirt. Look at the, look at the image. Oh, and this material is really soft too. Look. <laughs> my dad does not think YouTube is serious, man. He just, he just walks through my videos like it's nothing. Okay, so here's the t-shirt on. It looks good. I think this is the right amount of oversize that would look good on me. So, I don't know. Some people, I feel like some people would say this material is kind of cheap, but I kind of like it. It's like really soft and, you know, what can I say? I like this t-shirt. Um, next. Okay, so next I want to show you guys the black area 51 oversized t-shirt in a size small and <laughs> Okay Let me try it on, hold on It's so funny. Okay, so this is how it looks. This was on sale, I think. This was eleven dollars, and I just I just got it because it was funny. 
Yeah, I paid $11 for funny. <laughs> and I say this is worth it. Because this is like, I don't know, part of funny reminder of how weird things have gotten over the years. But yeah, it's like I could sleep in this, I could go out in it, I could style it, and I like it. Okay? Next! Next, I got a charcoal gray friends photographic printed wash t shirt in a size S small. And Ooh, I love friends. If you're a fan, a friends fan, comment down below. Cool story, um, my mom used to watch Friends when she came to United States to um, learn English. So it was like the, Friends was like the first uh, American show that she watched. <laughs> and yeah, so this shirt is cool, man. Yeah, let me try it on. Okay, so this is what it looks like on. And I will say, this shirt is smaller than the rest, and I got all of them in um, size small, but this one is a little bit smaller, but it still looks good on me, but yeah, um, nothing much to say, it's a gray t-shirt, but I like the pop of colors, um, you know, the Friends logo, uh, it is what it is. <laughs> um, I probably style this with um, shorts or sweats like these, but I really like this. Uh, comment down below if you're a Friends fan and say who's your favorite character. For me, I like Ross. I think Ross is funny. I like how dork he is, but yeah. <laughs> Next one, let's do the white Brooklyn slogan oversized t-shirt, size small. Okay, so here goes next t-shirt. It's just the basic. It says Brooklyn. And I got a lot of New York shirts in this haul, but yeah, I always wanted to go to New York, Brooklyn. If I could, I would go um, go travel places and maybe these shirts will mean more once I get to travel over there. But right now, it's just for style. I like the... Just the basic print. I think it looks cool. Um, there's it like this, or with some shorts again, some jeans, and it's I don't know. I just like it. <laughs> I think I got two more, two more uh, graphics. Next one. Let's do green Costa Rica printed tie dye T-shirt um, in a size small. And I just got this because the print really basic. I like the print. I like the tie-dye effect. I think it looks cool and fun, you know. Put some maybe like tan shorts, tan wagger shorts. Uh, but yeah, I just like this because it's fun. Looked looked pretty and green is my favorite color, so let's see, let's try it on. Okay, here it goes. Number whatever t-shirt this is. But this one says Costa Rica. It's a green, white tie dye, tie dye shirt. And I really like it. I think it's cute. I think it's fun. Yeah. Okay. Two more. No. Not even two more. I got a lot of more stuff. Mm -hmm. I might do a separate haul. Just because I got way too much stuff to put in one. I think this video will be like a graphic t-shirt, a graphic tee haul from Pretty Little Things. So I think I think that's what I'm gonna do. Okay, so I fixed the lighting. I think for like half the video, the, the, the video is kind of dark. Um, next thing I wanna show y'all is the Ash Gray Chicago slogan oversized t-shirt. I got this in a size small. Uh, it's another one of those printed text t-shirts. 
Ooh, this this material is really nice. It's that jersey material. Oh, it's that jersey material. I like how it's like the speckled type of gray. It's not like a plain gray t-shirt. It has like those little lines, if you know what I mean. But this is so cute. Again, never been to Chicago, but one maybe one day after Corona and all that. Okay, so this is what it looks like on. And I like this. Oh, it'd be cute even if you tied it like this. Show a little bit of tummy. This is really nice. I like this. Again, same, just plain Chicago text print. Uh, and you know, I'm kind of sad they don't have like something from San Francisco or the like, Bay Area. It's a pretty little thing. If you're watching this, do something in like San Francisco. You do a San Francisco t shirt like this in like orange or black or something. This is. If it was a San Francisco t shirt, I would buy it definitely. And I think a lot of people would because I don't know, San Francisco's like. Um, Iconic, I guess, but Chicago will do. <laughs> but yeah, good material. I like the color, I like the fabric, and yeah, A. Plus. Next, next, I want to show you guys these two like t shirt, um, t shirt dresses, and one it's called the khaki vertical striped oversized boyfriend t shirt dress, uh, size 2 US. Um, and I hope it fits kind of big. I hope it's not like uh, I need to stop talking when I'm opening the bags. I know some people that might be irritating, but here's how it looks. Okay, this might be cute, but Okay, so This is what it looks like This one's okay. This one's cute. I intended to wear it like a dress like a white bucket hat. Ooh. You get what I'm doing here? Like the white bucket hat and the white socks and the sneakers. That might be cool. You could maybe tie it like this too. I don't know. I feel like it's the arms. I feel like it's the arms that make it look weird. Yeah, I don't know about this. I don't know. I had a vision, but I liked it because the, the little, uh, what's this called? You know what I mean, this thing. I like when it's thick. And I like when it's like, I don't know, it's like a mock, mock neck kind of. But, it's okay. Um, I'll try to style it and see how it looks, but the arms are weird. That's all. Arms are weird, but I like the color. I love green. And yeah, it falls like right above my thigh. I mean, my knee. Um, but it's okay. Here's what it is. Bought it already, and I think the uh, the next one's gonna look the same. So the next one is the orange vertical stripe t-shirt dress, size four. Size four. Yeah. Oh no, this one's bigger. <laughs> this one's bigger than the one I already have. Okay, so here goes this t-shirt, and hmm, I shouldn't have bought these, man. These are kind of expensive, but I think to make it look a little more better, I'm going to um, tighten this, sew it so that the armpits are tighter, so that way it'll look more uh, fitted. But yeah, it's just the arms that look weird. The arms were like this see what i mean the arms are like this it look a little bit better but yeah i tied it like this yeah it's okay it's okay i tried to be stylish and never worked out but <laughs> i'll just stick to basics i feel like these are the type of t-shirts that nobody buys and, um, this is probably like like an overstock t-shirt or t-shirt that goes on sale because no one would buy it and I get why now but 
I'm gonna try to fix it. I'm gonna try to sew it, make it look a little better for me. What's next? Oh! That's weird. I plan to try this on second. Because I started the video off with this uh, this one. This one in root. Ru <laughs> in rust. What the heck? In rust. Yeah. I don't know. My brain was my brain was glitching. It was lagging. Okay, so yeah, this one is the rust color and a uh, pretty little thing embroidered t-shirt. And this one is the gray. I didn't try this one on yet. So. Okay, so here's it. Here's the t-shirt on. And yeah, it looks the same. I feel like I have such a short torso and the, the shirt is like for tall people. I don't know, I still like it. I, it just gives me like old vintage, like old vintage t shirt vibes. Like, I think I could wear this to sleep, to go out. I'm gonna try to style it somehow. No, I feel like this is just like a com comfy t shirt, like a lounge t shirt. You could style it up, but. I think I just wanted this because the embroidered name. But yeah. Okay. Um I think I'm gonna end the video here. Um I have more stuff, but this video would be way too long. So I'm gonna cut it into the next video and there and that bag is kind of like a different style. It's more like basics and casual, like uh, casual material. So, so yeah, I think that's gonna be it for this haul. Um, I hope you enjoyed. I hope you like some items, and I, I'm gonna link everything down below so you guys can go shop them. I'm still trying to figure out how to like do an intro and an outro. I just feel so awkward trying to talk like a YouTuber. I'm really just like a quiet normal person with no friends so <laughs> some people might like cringe i mean trying to make become like a youtuber but you know what i'm bored it's quarantine i bought a lot of stuff i like watching hauls and yeah so that's it i hope you guys enjoyed um stay tuned for the next video i'm gonna do another haul another pretty little thing haul and i also have some stuff from Boohoo that just got delivered to me today. So that's another haul. But yeah, that's it for this video. Um, like, comment, subscribe if you want. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.